What is going on, guys? Insane Juggernaut back with another video, and today I'm gonna be bringing you guys some uh, more gameplay, man. Got another boss guy that I think some people might want to see gameplay on. He looks like he has the best stats out of any wide out in the game. So I think you guys know where I'm going with this one. But um, we have none other than Herman Moore, boss legend, to get some gameplay on. Um, His stats look pretty sick base. But uh, after all the boosts, he's all 99s and... Uh, strength, agility, speed, acceleration, catching, 97 jumping, so um, good looking card here, gonna uh, get him through some uh, league drives against my uh, league mates, league has not opened yet, let me go ahead and show you guys, uh, league hasn't opened yet, so we're uh, gonna have to get that league drives with Jug episode out later on tonight. Just because the league guys haven't even opened yet. But I'm um, going to play some of my uh, league guys. And then um, see what this Herman Moore can do. So uh, we'll see you guys at the first drive. First drive, we're going to be taking on the Kamish Larry. Uh, 100 overall defense just to kind of get us warmed up. So we'll see what Herman Moore can do here. We're probably going to just kind of get him warmed up with some short to intermediate routes. And then we'll stretch him down the field vertically later on throughout the game. And we'll see how good he does. I have really high intentions on Herman Moore. I think that 97 jumping and that 99 speed will definitely coexist very well. So let's see what we got. First play, we're going to warm him up with curls. Looks like zone coverage. It's cover three. Yeah. Do realize we are force, uh, forcing the ball to Herman Moore, so um, certain plays, certain plays, Herman Moore is um, well, we're gonna take a sack certain plays because Herman Moore isn't gonna be open. So understand that is gonna be the case. Good route by Herman Moore. <clears throat> Third and nine, trips corner strike. Might be countered, semi counter. Yeah. Fourth and 16, much PA dig. Huge snagger by Herman Moore. Got to get focused on the gameplay. Um, let's get warmed up. Slants middle. We're reading Herman Moore to Dorset. Dorset's going to be open. Yeah. So we're actually just going to make the right reads in these situations. Try to for force the ball to Herman more when we can, but we're going to make the right reads and make sure that we don't get in a position where we're going to turn the ball over. Cross up, flipped. We want to get Herman more on this in route. It's not going to be open. <laughs> First and 10. Let's see what we want for Herman Moore. Spread P outs, flipped. Hopefully it's cover three. Looks like cover three. We'll be able to get Herman Moore on this out route. Yes, yeah, a corner blitz, which is perfect. There we go. First and goal. Want to get Herman Moore in the end zone. So we're going to call deep cross. And we're going to throw it to Herman Moore as soon as he fakes the post. This is out and up. Well, posting up. but And there we go. Touchdown Herman Moore. Herman Moore gets in the end zone um, first drive. I just noticed he's 6'4", and it, it, you can kind of see it in his character. So um, Herman Moore definitely gets in the end zone. We're just going to run strong eye halfback toss and see how Herman Moore blocks. So um, Herman Moore is actually going to chip block on Ricardo Allen, so let's see how he chips. Pretty good seal. But uh, a lot of traffic and garbage there. But Herman Moore did his job there, so he looks good as a blocker as well. So we'll see what Herman Moore does second drive, but first drive, Herman Moore does score. Second drive against 101 overall squad. Let's see what Herman Moore can do here. One thing I noticed about Herman Moore is his route running is very, very crisp. Um, route running is a hidden stat in Madden Mobile, so you can't see it on the card, but I'm pretty sure Herman Moore has very high route running. And that 
also constitutes something to be a boss card. So, I'm gonna go um motion cross flipped. We're gonna try to get her more man coverage. So we might just yeah, we're gonna lob it. Nothing you can do there. That's one thing about wide receiver gameplays. It's kind of not me because I personally like to make reads, but we're just going to try to force the ball to her more. And that's the drop. Third and 10. Going to go spot here. Semi counter. Her more so gets the first down. Okay, first and 10. Spread slot flags. We're going to read one to two. Grunk to Herman Moore. Hopefully, Herman Moore gets open. He will get open. We do want to get him on a vertical route right now. So, we're going to go motion cross. We're not going to flip it this time. Then, we're just going to throw Herman Moore the post. And Herman Moore comes down with the catch. Five man coverage and Herman Moore comes down with it. So uh that's Mad Mobile for you. But um first and ten, half back angle, we're gonna get Herman Moore on this out route. There's a touchdown there. Herman Moore's in the end zone again. So um Herman Moore feels pretty good as a wide receiver right now, I'm not gonna lie. I think he's doing everything you want him to do. He definitely has the speed. To stretch down the field vertically at 99, 97 jumping allows him to make any catch that you want him to make. And uh, very crisp route running, solid hands. He did have a drop this drive, but uh, you never really know whether it's an actual drop or it's kind of just with animations sometimes with Mad Mobile. But um, Herman Moore definitely doing his thing right now. So we're going to go to the next drive, see if we can keep it going with Herman Moore. Third drive, more Herman Moore action. We're going against the Raiders. See what Herman Moore can do in this uh, stadium right here. We're going to put him through the gauntlet, man. We're going to make him run every route, so you don't have to worry about that. Bunch of spacing. We want to get him on this little inside hook route. Man coverage. Second and one, we're going to try to trip tight end stick and try to get Herman Moore on a go route. It looks like cover three, so he should be able to beat his man one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, my God. And Herman Moore just dusted his guy. Not sure what happened there. Wasn't really paying attention to that. I was paying attention to the defensive line, but he got like 10, 15 yards of separation. So I'm going to definitely look through the uh, film to see how that one turned out. But, Wow. I've never seen that much separation in Mad Mobile before. So that's that's pretty sick right there. So maybe Herman Moore as a deep threat is what we need to look at him as. So next drive, we're going to throw some more deep routes to Herman Moore and see how, how good he stretches the field because that was pretty sick. Up next, we're against my guy Cheeks, 99 overall defense. We get our first division matchup. So let's see how the Lions do against their rivals here. I'm sure Herman Moore has had some great games at Soldier Field. Definitely want to throw that in there. So, see if he can keep that trend up. We'll actually get out near the 10-yard line if we can. 12-yard line, that works. <laughs> Trips double post. See if we can get her more on this post. Not my favorite route, but um Her and Moore makes a spectacular catch there. So uh there's a first down. I think her and Moore might be able to do things that certain other wide receivers can't do. Just seeing some of the catches he's coming down with. So um Double man, let's see if Herman Moore can beat double man coverage on the outside.
Okay. Second and ten. Actually gonna spot throw something to my guy real quick. Let's go post corners or we're just gonna spot throw it. Third and three. Strong eye fullback metal. Try to get Herman Moore on the go route right again. Double coverage. See if Herman Moore can come down with it. And he actually beats them in double coverage. So Herman Moore with another touchdown. He beats double coverage there. You don't really see that coverage get beat often. So definitely not going to take that for granted. That was a great play by Herman Moore. And uh, he's definitely more of a vertical receiver than your short to intermediate guy. Not saying that he hasn't had the best hands, but he will drop a pass or two. So uh, Herman Moore looks like a vertical threat right now. That's what I'm seeing. He seems like what you would want a Randy Moss card to be. He plays like a Randy Moss. So um, we're going to get him on a, 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 a couple more drives and see what Herman Moore can do. Now we're getting to the big guns. This is 104 overall defense. So now we're going to just kind of see how Herman Moore plays against competition that you probably face every day now that Mad Mobile is the way it is. So uh, 104 overall defense, see if Herman Moore can do anything. Definitely want to get him on a hitch or something like that first. So we're going to actually go fullback flare, flip it, and hit Herman Moore on this hitch. Good route, great separation. If that was against another team, that corner might not have caught Herman Moore. But that is Eastern Night Train Lane, 99 speed, so... 98 speeds are, but same thing. Try to get that in there. Got that through the underneath defender, so there's a first down there. Yeah, definitely getting Herman Moore back to these uh, short routes. Spread FL drag. Usually I run this play flip, but we're just doing it for Herman Moore, so. Defenders came through quick there, okay. Um. Trips have back smash. Let's see how Herman Moore blocks. Okay, Herman Moore got a good block on his defender. Just couldn't get outside. Third and nine. I'm gonna go smash. Try to hit Herman Moore. He's double manned, but um still gonna find a way to get it in there to him. There we go. Really nice route, man. Herman Moore runs really nice routes. Simple slant route. Might be counter. Semi counter. Yeah, didn't even mean to throw the Gronk, but didn't want to get countered there and end up losing yards. Herm Moore runs a nice route against tight man coverage from Mark, uh, Night Train Lane. Let's see if he can beat Night Train Lane in one on one coverage, hopefully. Taxi cover. Cover two man, so. Yeah. First and 10, motion-wise stick, we'll try Herman Moore again. Now we get cover three, so we should see his cover four. But he still beats Night Train Lane, so touchdown for Herman Moore. That's against a 104 defense. Let's see how he blocks his halfback toss again. Nice, he got in there. Okay, but... um. As you can see, 104 overall defense. Herman Moore gets in the end zone. He beats Night Train Lane and the deep safety. So, Herman Moore is really looking good as deep throw right now. So, let's go to the next drive. Next drive, we're going against uh my guy B-Man. I think he's 98 defense. And then next, last drive, we'll go against my guy Matty, who I can't ever really seem to beat in these type of videos who is 102 defense, but he has the best game plan, personally, in my opinion, in the league. So we'll see how we can matriculate down the field against both of these teams. Trips off QB dash. I usually like to pull back and throw the uh, hitch route to Eifert, but this this time around we're going to go Herman Moore. 
Actually, we're going to probably throw it to Herman Moore before he goes for his little curl, because I've never tried that before. So let's see how that works in the route. Actually, a really nice route there. Okay. That might be something I have to sprinkle into the offense. Gets really nice separation before he breaks for the curl. So PA comebacks. Again, we're going to throw this before he comes back. Couldn't get it out early enough because of play action. But Herman Moore makes the catch, but he's out of bounds. Second and 10. Strong eye spacing. We're going to kind of spot throw it. Incomplete there. I'll count it as a drop. Probably isn't really a drop, but I'll count it as a drop. Wow. Don't know what the corner did there, but he was actually uh kind of stuck, but he like played good coverage at the same time. If that would have been a touchdown, I would have went crazy. That should have been a touchdown. I think a linebacker caught him. But you know how Mad Mobile works, man. That's a lot of fluke, but that would have been sick if that was a touchdown. Yeah, that was definitely a counter. We're trying to get it out to Herman Moore in open space. Post corner, we're going to throw it to Herman Moore when he goes in for the post. Touchdown Herman Moore. Herman Moore is... um. Definitely a vertical threat to me. Would I say that he's worth three mil that I paid for him? I would say he's. Hmm. I would pay two mil for him. I wouldn't pay three mil, but Herman Moore is definitely one of the best receivers in the game. But he does drop some passes, and um, I don't think that Boss Legend should be dropping anything. But. It is really more of an animation thing than just a hard on drop, so can't be too hard on Herman Moore for that. But Herman Moore is definitely a really good receiver, one of the better receivers I play with. I can't really think of a receiver that's better. It's just I haven't had really any crazy receivers anyway. You know, Bosh, Shad Johnson, and Super Bowl Julio, they're probably the best guys I play with so far over anybody else, and you know they're cool. But there's not really even a crazy receiver in the game. I think we kind of need 100 stats to see that. But um, last drive is going to be against my guy, Medi, who has probably the best game plan in the league. And he has a 102 defense, so we'll see if we can score on him. Last drive against my guy, Medi. This is the Super Bowl of defenses. So let's see if Herman Moore can... Do these guys the same way that he's been doing these guys. To really turn vibration off for videos, huh? Anyway, first down. Spot. Not counter, so that's a good thing. Second and one. That's where we want to go for our deep ball. So, um... Go right with Herman Moore. Let's see what coverage we're in. Cover three. Herman Moore beat him. He beat him. The separation that Herman Moore gets on his go routes is unlike any other receiver I've ever seen. He gets really good separation. He runs great routes. And he did something I don't really see with other receivers. He caught the ball in stride. That's 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 pretty sick. Let's go. Spread PA out, try to hammer him on his out route. Meant to flip it, but man coverage. Wow, what was that? It like bounced off of his chest and he like caught it with one hand. Like while he was coming. That was a pretty sick animation. Ooh, and a nice little celebration animation too. That's gonna do it for the video. Um I would say Herman Moore is the best deep threat in the game. I would say that he will drop some passes for you, but you probably expect that with any receiver just because of how the animations work in Madden Mobile. But, man, I mean, Herman Moore is a beast. And um, I do think he's the best receiver in the game. I really do. I think he's definitely better than uh, Boss Odell Beckham. I think the only reason Boss Odell Beckham gets a lot of clout is because he gives plus five speed. But 
Herman Moore is definitely the best receiver. I think Odell's a little too short at 5'11 to be considered the best receiver in the game. So that is something you also have to think about. He might be a good slot, but he might not. He he can't do what Herman Moore does at 6'4 with 97 jumping and 99 speed. Just not possible. But Herman Moore makes a sick catch there. That's the best way to end the game play. We finally get one up on my guy, Matty, who I haven't scored on in the Dante Culpepper or Ricky Williams gameplay. So Herman Moore gets us in the end zone against this guy. He gets two thumbs up from me. If you can get Herman Moore for 2.5 mil or less, do it. Herman Moore is a beast. That's going to wrap the video up, though. It's been your boy Insane Juggernaut with another video. I'm signing out. Peace.